what is up guys it is spooky here i'm back with another minecraft video finally all right so today we're gonna make another ghost client video so today we're going to be showcasing the entropy 2.0 remastered so as you guys can see i have bad line client here um so now entropy finally supports bad line client so you can inject this into bad line client and it will bypass um so i'm gonna close up bad line client real quick so yeah, let's inject um, entropy. So, I've disguised it as my audacity.exe. So, here we go. You want to click on inject. It doesn't even ask me for administrator permission, which I really like. So, yeah. Really cool. And there you go. It is injected. Like, it injects instantly, basically. So, that's really nice. Really convenient, if I would say so. So, so let's make some undetectable settings. So, you guys can copy my settings down because these are going to be undetected. And you can use it. It won't flag any anti cheats. I can promise you that. So I'm not. I'm not gonna be like blatantly cheating in this video. I'm gonna be like closet cheating basically. This is what I will use if I was closet cheating. So you guys can copy my settings. Um, I always use five distance. And for my FOV, now this is really important because a lot of people get confused. But you wanna go to your options and you see where it says FOV. I use 70 because I use normal FOV. Actually, I, I use like 80 or something. I use 80 sometimes, but right now I'm gonna use 70 just in case that most of you guys probably use that. So you wanna keep your FOV at 70. If your Minecraft FOV is at 70, click aim, ignore naked, sure. Axe and swords, of course, of course. Enable, and you can bind all of these by the way. You can bind all of these to your desire. So if you want to toggle off reach because your opponent is too easy, go ahead and do so. So let's go reach now. We're gonna use like I never mess if whenever I'm closet cheating, I never mess with the min distance. I always mess with the max distance. So we're gonna use like 3.0 to 3.3, and we're gonna use only while sprinting. Actually, we're gonna use um yeah that's fine that's actually fine and guys you can actually precisely edit your settings so let's say i want to do this you want to um left control and you want to click on it and you can type your settings in you can do some crazy ass numbers um i don't know you can do that <laughs> holy shit <laughs> 69 million reach okay let's let, let's let's don't go that far let's if you guys are gonna use like if you if you guys are gonna mess with your mint distance, I recommend having this option on because it makes it look way more legit and having this on will set off less reach logs or less chance because sometimes if you get hits when you're standing still, you obviously will set off logs. So I'm gonna use this and have this option on, which is only while sprinting. Now let's go to the velocity part. Um we're gonna toggle this on. I'm gonna use like 95. I'm gonna use like a hundred, I mean 90% and do not use kite because yeah, it's for HCF it explains it. Yo, he has tooltips. Okay Wait, there's only two tips for um kite. There's like, nothing else though. Yeah, it's only kite So I assume oh there you go multiplier. Yeah, you can multiply your KP So you get more knockback basically so throw pot um, I use this a lot. Um, I would never recommend using zero MS because that's really blatant I personally recommend using a hundred um, do not go below 70 if you're gonna use throw pot because it will look so obvious in recordings like when you're recording a video You have timer which I'm not gonna use because it's detectable x-ray for HCF Perfect for faithful actually. I'm um, really nice. Um, I just realized he's kind of missing spawners um, Player ESP we're gonna have player ESP on just for you guys Usually I don't use this crap like I don't use this crap, but I'm doing it for you guys because you guys probably want to see it and this chroma of course if you want chroma But I don't want that because chroma is rainbow and rainbows for gay people Actually, we're gonna talk about on why not? <laughs> um, and we have friends. I don't have any friends, so I'm just gonna add Myself as a friend because I don't have any friends. Well, there you go. You got spooky as a friend now um, You can self-destruct and you can hide so yeah, that's pretty much it and I'll see you guys in the gameplay Alright, welcome back guys. We're now in game and we're gonna do like a couple of fights with Entropy Ghost Client. So this is the remastered version and what that means is that the entire Ghost Client is basically recoded and this is C++ by the way so you can expect some high quality stuff here. And you guys might be like, oh it looks like drip, which is true. 
Um, the menu is exactly the same as the old version of Drip, if you guys remember that, if you're OG Dripper, like me. I'm oh, just kidding, I'm not like an OG Dripper. Actually, I am, because I think I'm one of the first person to use the original Drip, like V1. Yeah, you can see the ESP, you can kind of see it, it's rainbow, like around it. It's kind of hard to see, but you guys can probably see it if you slow it down a little bit. And as you guys can see, the throw pot is very legit, like it doesn't even look blatant. It looks like me just... Um, manually throwing them down so oof I'm getting destroyed right here but right now it looks pretty legit so this is the legit config you guys can feel free to pause the video and copy the settings down and I'm gonna turn off the ESP after this match or the next game I'm gonna turn it off the next game because it's kind of killing my frames here as you guys know I have a really bad computer and I do want to say that this video is sponsored I am paid but regardless, this is still my honest opinion on the client. No bias whatsoever. If I say the only thing that's kind of lacking is um, the stream proof part. I wish there's like more stream proof options because you guys know that vape plug, it has like stream proof features. I think entropy is like, it's the best you can get. It's like, I think the pricing is $17. He recently increased it since, you know, 2.0 is much, much better. We got to speed up. In a second actually so let's see all right we're gonna speed up please do not kill me while I'm speeding up all right thank you wow he's like aggro purling already wow what a what a what a dude like you still play minecraft like really sweating but anyways so far so good the aim assist it looks really legit it doesn't even look like I'm using aim assist because it's it's that good and it's still giving me like a really big advantage. It's kind of hard to spot, obviously, because of the video. But trust me, it, it really is. Alright, let's... And the inventory fill is working perfectly. I, I always like to have my auto-clicking working with my inventory. That's really good. And as you guys can see, that's the reach right there. I just got that reach right there. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. Yikes. Alright, let's end this fight quickly. Come on. Come on, dude. Just give up and let me devour you. Oh, oh, okay, okay. That was a little bug with, with the throw pot. It didn't like, you guys saw that? Like it, it went to my um, pot, but it didn't actually throw it. So there are still some bugs, obviously. 2.0 just released. It's not perfect, all right? Nothing is perfect to the bare bone. <laughs> wow, this is gonna like carry on forever. Oh, come on, I just got a combo. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, wait, what the heck? What the? Wait, what is this? Wait, what? Is this like a new map design? The fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Alright, come on. Where are you going, buddy? Let's finish this guy off. End the video. Actually, I gotta do one more match because I gotta turn off the ESP and then play with it, you know? Alright, we gotta speed up. Yeah, this is a pretty long fight. My, uh... My fire resistance is already at the 4 minute mark. I swear, if we lose to this guy, I'm going to be so mad. Okay, there we go. We got him. So I'll see you guys in the next match. Peace. Alright, I'm back, boys. So we're on our last match here. I have disabled my ESP. And as you guys can see, my FPS is like much better. Like it's having like a, like a 10 extra FPS increase. So if you guys have a crappy computer like me, don't use the player ESP. Because <laughs> it kind of ruins with your FPS a little bit. So let's see what happens this round. Oh, this guy has one of those scary looking skins. Oh, it's got a pretty good combo right there. Let's go. And while I'm doing this, I want to talk about um, uh, the, my channel. So you guys have noticed that I haven't been uploading much uh, Minecraft content, which, you know, obviously uh, I did explain in my April Fool's video. Like a lot of you guys thought I was actually quitting, which is kind of funny. But part of what I said in that video is actually true. I did lost interest in Minecraft, so that's part of the reason why I haven't been uploading Minecraft. I've been streaming a lot of CSGO, and you know, I really want to cheat in CSGO, just that I lack of some resources, that's all. So far, you know, Entropy, for its price, you can't really find anything else at its price range. Well, maybe Whiteout, yeah, that's definitely something that you can look up if you are looking for something at its price range, but I think, personally, Entropy is one of the best budget-friendly clients. If not the best, because like, what else can you find that's in C++, like fully C++ and 
act that uh, is actually good because I know that there's a lot of skids in the community and Fury is one of like he's 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 really talented for who for his age I guess so I can trust him and use his product so it's perfect for HCF practice PvP you can you know climb elo scoreboards I don't know whatever you want with it but let's finish up this guy quickly so I can end the video Ooh, he's, he just got combo right there look at this look at this reach I'm using the same settings so it still looks very legit regardless so you guys should probably use misplace if you want to use this in recordings yeah you can like use this if you're like a youtuber you're not gonna get caught like as of right now nothing detects it it's like an undetected ghost clan right now cuz I know the SS tools can't find this at least right now so oh oh that was close that was close yo he needs to fix like the throw bot sometimes it doesn't throw that's like the only complaint I have right now and maybe um, I like how they stick with the blue theme like you can't change a color which I really like he stick with a certain color scheme like I, I hate how the whole ghost client industry has shifted into the RGB trend like I'm, I'm glad that some ghost clients like whiteout and entropy they, they stick with their color scheme but of course entropy 1.0 was um, rainbowish you know you can customize the colors all right come on let me finish you let me finish you buddy come on for fuck's sake oh come on come on quick drop oh I guess not damn it all right, we're gonna speed up again before I die. All right, concentrating right now on this fight. Okay, that was close, that was close. I mean, at least we're getting really good fights. Like, I'm happy that I'm not getting quick drop because like, you know, on some servers, everybody just quick drops. Like, I hate those type of servers. It's really not fun. Like these long lasting fights are really fun to watch. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, I'll make sure to leave a like. And if you want to see more videos, subscribe and hit that bell. And make sure to check out Entropy in the description below. I'll leave a link to their website and you can check out at purchase. Unfortunately, I don't have a referral code. So yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out and happy new year. I'm just joking. I'm bad at making jokes.